All right, we good. Five seconds in, we good. It's your boy Hobbs Lee here. Do it to life for life. Do it to you. Do it to 2021. These videos getting shorter. Days going by quicker. Still working on the program. Still thinking about some things. But what it ball down to is today did make a major overhaul. I did get that big mattress out of here. I did clean out my backyard. All that stuff is gone. Now I can get back in and rearrange. And I ask myself, what's the one thing that I could do that such by doing it would make everything else easy, unnecessary with cleaning this basement? And that is focusing on finish laying the, lap, the, the laminate flooring. That's what I got to focus on. Laying the laminate flooring. It's got to be focused on. It's got to be done. So that's going to be the next project on the list, right? That's what I'm thinking, right? That's what I'm thinking. Plus, on top of that, I did listen to a little bit of the one thing today. Man, I definitely like it. think it's one of the best books ever. Hope you got a copy. But what I got out of that today was, uh, it was talking about discipline life. Having enough discipline to form the habit. Only one habit. And that's why I'm standing there getting the habit of shooting videos every single day. No matter how short or how long. Just getting that habit of, of shooting them without going to bed. I already did my jumping jacks. I didn't get on my elliptical today, so tomorrow I'm going to have to. But we had a busy day. We got a lot of exercise in. We burned a lot of calories a day. But just focusing on getting back on my elliptical, focusing on the program that I got as far as I think I can consolidate me, my wife, my son, daughter, God, I'm going to get on the same page then just focus all of our energies on one core business to get that started. Instead of us all trying to start a business, let's focus on what we got. Let's take what we got in our own house like the widow's oil. She got, hey, go get your family. Tell them what you got in the house. Here's the plan. Focus on one thing. And that one thing was the one resource that they did have in the house, which was the widow's oil. But they did have to go out collectively into the community and engage other people knocking on doors, seeking for pots, seeking for vessels in order to contain that. So I guess that's sort of like a marketing strategy, meaning that you first find a target for your resources or an audience for your product. Make sure that you're going to be feeling a need. And all back in that day, it was a serious need. Because now you can go in the oil business. If you got a surplus more than anybody else got, then you come in at lower prices and everybody win because you got this certain surplus. You see what I'm saying? And that's what we have here. We have a surplus of talent and artistry in this house. So since we got that surplus, then we need to go ahead and try to put that out. So on that aspect, I guess I should be working on the target audience, right? Lookalike audience, I'm going to have to start running some ads. I'm going to take my Shopify. I'm going to scale it back to half, revamp the website, and then get into my Wix, check it out, look at my business accounts, and then we're going to um, crank up on my Facebook ads. Yeah, we have to. Therefore, my son's artistry business can get off the ground. He'll love to see that happen. I think it's a wonderful talent. Then my wife, when she go ahead and retire, she has something to keep herself busy. She got a little garden going. She may need to start recording on a YouTube channel on that. But she's looking forward to that as well, too. And me, you know, I'm all about the, the mental cancer. The mental cancer. Especially, I want to get into, look up a group. I'll probably do that this week. They kind of focus on that psychological aspect of cancer patients and, you know, as far as uh, breast cancer patients and the psychological aspects on the families as well, too, you know. And so I know there's some groups out there. I know there's some some uh, resources out there. So I'm going to start looking at that and moving towards that door to see if it's an automatic door that's already open and those strategic um, plans that kind of come together. Right, still watching my um, nice show on Discovery Channel. Hope you guys have been watching it as well too. It's called Undercover Billionaire. I like that show. If you have another show similar to that, 
They can kind of walk us through the steps, kind of open up some thinking for some people to just kind of tune in, put it in the comments below. Uh, I'm going to head up here and get some rest, spend a little bit of time with my wife. Uh, so smash that thumbs up and then subscribe and then hit that notification bell. I hadn't put none of that stuff on there, so maybe I'll start doing that too, right? Okay, all right. And tomorrow, guess what? Tomorrow, four agreements. Four agreements. Let's read some out of four agreements. I'm going to listen to the four agreements tomorrow. It's going to always be on doing my best and putting in the work. Doing my best, putting in the work, and going for no by not making assumptions.